this video we're going to look at how to create a QR code. It's a quick reference code. You can use this with text, um, it can be web addresses, it could be phone numbers, it could be a paragraph. There's all kinds of different things you can do with this. So in this example, I want my kids to be able to scan a QR code that'll take them to the root for Walk the Solar System. Um, so I'm going to grab the web address up here, the URL. I'm going to hit copy. I'm going to use this website. There's all kinds of QR code generators, so if you forget this one, um, you can just look up QR code generator in a search. And I like this one, beautiful QR codes. Thanks to Mr. Boyd at North Peace, I think he showed me this one. And you just change this to be whatever your text is. Your text is. And then you would hit generate. And this QR code, if you were to scan it with a QR code reader, it will say whatever your text is. Dot, 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 dot. Now I actually want to put my web address in there, so I'm going to paste that in there. I'm going to hit generate. And that gives me a different um, QR code. From here, I could save this image. And if I'm on my iPad, I just save it onto my iPad, and then I can project it up on the screen and have my kids use their iPads to, uh, to scan it. Or if it's one that you're going to use quite often, like the uh, rubric for uh, impromptu writing, uh, that's a good one to have printed off and put it up on the wall so that the kids can scan it all the time. So those ones you want to scan all the time or quite frequently the kids do it at different times. Those are good ones to print in and put on the wall. This one I could hit save and post it on a projector. Now when you save it, make sure you uh, give it a name that actually means something so you can easily find it later on because otherwise it'll just look like every other QR code and you'd have to scan it to see where it goes to. So that's a very quick look at how to create quick response codes. There's lots of great ideas with this, like using timelines, having a whole bunch of different QR codes that kids have to scan, read the text, and then order them around, and then tell the story about their timeline. So there's a, an interesting one right off the bat in 10 seconds, an idea. So hopefully you can find some great uses for QR codes, and if you do, let me know.